What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Civil Engineering Academy. This is Jason. All right, so this question says for the wall form work, if the height of the wall is equal to 12 feet and the distance between the incline support is 3 feet. Okay, and we're pouring concrete with a unit weight of 145 PCF. Let's find out what is the force in the support if we assume it's at 45 degree angle. Okay, so in this picture, it shows that the uh, this is the wall form and is supported by this inclined supports at three feet apart, right? And the wall height right here is going to be 12 feet, okay? And this inclined support is attached to the uh, the top of the the form, the form work, okay? And there's a, another um, longitudinal support at the bottom right here okay so um, since we're pouring concrete it is going to subject provide some lateral pressure to the um, the form work okay so if we take just a unit length here at one foot of the form then let's draw a simplified model here we have a, uh, a a lateral support, a roller support at the bottom, and another hinge support right here. And this one, the support at the top, will represent the lateral reactions of this incline support. Okay, R. Let's call this R. All right. And then for this unit length of form work, it is going to be subjected to lateral pressure. And we call the maximum pressure at the bottom P max. This is going to be the unit weight of the concrete times the height, okay, times the height of the wall. All right. Okay. So, um, and this is this is the resultant force of the per pressure profile. So that will be P max, okay, times H divided by two. So that will give you gamma C H squared divided by two. We call this F. And in order to calculate, in order to determine our reaction here at the top, we take moment at the bottom support, okay. So if we take moment to this point, your F times H divided by three equals to your R times H, right? So your R is F divided by 3, one-third. So that's gamma C H square, right? Divided by 6, and this will give you 3480 POF, okay? Per, per length, uh, per foot, okay? Per unit foot, okay? Um, but at, at the end, you are going to calculate the total reaction at one support here, okay? So because these supports are three feet apart, so three feet of the uh, reactions will apply to one support, okay? So the total reaction to one support will be your R times three, three feet, right? So that's 3480 POF times three feet, okay? So that's 10,440 pound, right? Um, finally, we're looking for the force inside this support. So we're looking for the axle force of this uh, support. All right, so now we can we, we calculate that the lateral reaction will be 10,440, okay, and at a 45 degree, right? So this this guy will be 10,440 divided by cosine 45 degree, okay? So this will give you 14. 
1,764 pound. So this is closest to 1476 kips. Okay, so your answer will be B. All right, so that's it for today. Thank you for watching.